All right, so I'm like immediately just finished up the gla uh, glass suit and glasses video. Glasses video. It was, it was pretty interesting. I mean, so shockingly, shocking, shocking results, which I wasn't really expecting. But anyways, we're not talking about that today. So today I'm actually going to be going over my mod my new upgrades. If you guys seen in a few videos on my air rifle, new my DPMS air rifle from uh, Crossman. It's a like I said, like I said in the review video, uh, it was a it's a really great it's really good. I mean I really like I said I really like it. It's worth the money. On on average, I think it's like 200, 200, 250 or something like that. I spent, I checked on Amazon because I bought it off Amazon. I checked. It is. It, I caught. I spent. It was 170. Yeah, before all the shipping and stuff because they got like H faster shipping or whatever. Um. Yeah. So, anyways, I got this from. Airsoft, Airsoft Atlanta, it's a mock suppressor. At first I thought, okay, it's an actual suppressor, I'll, it'll silence it a lot, but it ended up being a mock suppressor. I wanted to get it so it can look nice now, look a little bit nicer. Um, I like it, like I said, I like it. But I'm, like I said, I do like, probably like 20, 40, 20, 30 minutes ago, maybe 45 minutes ago, I bought the, um, What's it called? Actual air airsoft suppressor from Norwich, U.S. I think I said it right. Norwich, U.S.A. It should be here in a couple of days because I paid for the faster shipping because I I really needed. I should have gotten it a long time ago. But anyways, yeah, I'll probably do a video on that. Um, okay, onward. So I got this from Amazon as well. I was uh. Looking around, like probably like a month or two, like a month or two ago, and I found it. Found this on Evike, Evike or Evic or whatever it's called, for 150. I'm like, I'm not spending 150 dollars on a scope. So I went on them. I copied and pasted this. Found it on Amazon for 70 dollars. So I bought it because I was spent saving so much money and it was a lot less. On anyways, it's onward. Let's continue. Um, this, this, uh, bipod, I saw it on, on, online, I looked nice, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna get that, and I, it was like 20, I think it was like 25, 26 dollars, something like that, but it was, it's nice, like I said, it's, it's, I really enjoy it, um, how long has this video been? Three minutes. Okay, so, I'm on... I'm also now I'm going to talk about my future upgrades for this. Um, my plan is, uh, let's see here. I want to do a few little modifications. What I want, like I said, I want to get the um, I'm got the uh, actual suppressor on the way. Um, probably I might I'm gonna keep those because they're nice, but this. This got this. This is gonna go. I wanted something else. Uh, I forgot what it's. It, uh, it's on. I forgot what website it's on. I haven't saved. I just don't remember what it was. I'll, oh yeah, I got the sticker for the from Airsoft Atlanta. Uh, let's see here. What else? Um, I'm gonna get stick-on grips for this to so put on this. I might actually get a, a custom trigger on this and for the big thing big part of this of the modifications will be is this I don't like it I don't like it one bit it's uncomfortable it's weird it just feels weird so what I'm doing is once I get everything once everything is started to get on a steady steadier schedule for me and I have all my own my own uh, 3D printer and stuff, which will probably be soon after I buy a car. Uh, yeah. Um, let's see. Yeah, so I'm gonna actually redesign this. Well, what I did, what I want to do is take a similar design of this, bring this part right here forward all the way. Like, will that look right? Yeah, it will. 
bring this part forward all the way like right about right here and then this part will be slightly changed wait will that work yeah because i'll have it like i have this part up right in between here so i can like uh what i'll what i'm gonna what i plan on doing is having a little slide thing on the bottom and then have it be able to slide it just it's like i slide the thing open i can pull the thing down and move it whenever, wherever i want and then slide it back slide it back to hold it in place and then what i'm gonna do is um this part's gonna be like i said it's probably gonna have like a little slither of your opening and i like i'm also gonna have a lot more space and in that space will be a little slot on the on either on the bottom or in the back for uh to hold extra cartridges i'll probably do like one or two or th maybe probably two like i uh, definitely two but i'm gonna i'm shooting for three or four i mean i want to try to have four extra cartridges so because i want to have one more i one more i feel, one more I, feel, I, feel I can speak whenever i'm filming a video with this i always forget two things my uh allen wrench to change the cartridges and the cartridges so i'm always forgetting about it and so if i just have it in the uh stock like that it'd be a lot easier and uh like i said and then for, to keep it so to keep it closed we'll have the same design right same similar design but like a little bit more curvy but this back part will slide off and i can take the cartridges out like that way and then i'll have a little indent slot in here to hold the allen wrench so that's my plan for the stock um what else should I, which what else should i talk about and i read i think i can change that the barrel here so i'm gonna keep looking around if i can i'll definitely do that because that'll because then, then i can do some pretty cool things with it i can probably i can switch stuff up um what else let's see here i've talked about the uh suppressor i've talked about that um let's see here oh yeah i'm also probably gonna get a sling for it because it's it would be way easier for me to film videos like that but uh yeah like i said i really like it it was worth the money and yeah it's it's nice i like it but anyways is there anything else i need to talk about i don't remember i don't remember where i gonna do this at uh all right i think i'm done all right has been ben from the destruction slayer if you enjoyed this video make sure you subscribe turn on notifications let's get this video to like 30 likes and let's continue pushing to 100 subscribers this has been ben i'll see you next time on another video peace <laughs>